What is going on gamers? My name is Roxas Kowak and I'm the regular gamer of course and today we are back in Red Dead Redemption 2 again on our journal journey as you can see in the upper left hand corner. Now since the last episode I have done a little bit of like no research, somewhat research, a little bit of research, no research, whatever into uh, OBS and how OBS functions and what we can do in OBS. So I have a couple new things so check this out. Watch this. Three, two. That ah, didn't do anything, did it? That's what I meant to do. So yeah, no book, some book. So now you guys can get a better view of everything. And then if I click this key, that's the book. Check that out. I do, however, have a different type of microphone for this book, just because I'm actually away from my Blue Yeti microphone. I'm using my headset microphone that I listen to my for, game, for my game audio. But um, yeah, so if you guys don't remember what Journal Journey is, essentially, along the travels of Arthur Morgan in Red Dead Redemption 2, I'm going to be drawing in this book. And you ain't going to see what's in it yet, unless you watch the last episode, or until I open it again. So have fun waiting on that one. Um, don't play with knives. We'll start with that. I use the knife to sharpen the pencil. I also do have a pencil sharpener here. If I decide uh, it's an extremely dumb idea in the long run, who knows? Um, but yeah, Arthur Morgan's journal here. Get back to the game. Boop. Boop. Isn't that cool? All right, now, what were we doing in the last episode? We finally got to our campsite here. Dutch had a little speech. I think I was helping Pearson. Um, map. Let's start with the map and see what's available. So I got Uncle. I know I just saw Pearson. Pretty sure that's Butcher. Got a bunch of stuff around camp. Let's start with Pearson. I'm pretty sure Pearson Morning, just has to say something. How you doing, Pearson? All good there, Pearson. Still need more food, Mr. Morgan. Yeah, you should try your luck again with that bow. I know. I will. Fair enough. I'll be sure to bring some in sometime. I got Dutch and Molly over here. Fantastic well, duo. Okay, I'll catch you later then. All right then. All right, I guess we decided to say something and nothing all at once. Good talking Dutch. How you doing, Molly? Hey there. Hello. Good as always. All right. Take a little walk away. Uh, you know what? We're going to be we're going to be generous starting off. I'm going to contribute right here right now, the very start of uh Dutch's schemes and plans. And, uh, you know, he absolutely loves plans. So let's donate. Do I have two wallets? Or do I have... What, what if I just go max? What is the max going to say? 1820? Yeah, so I have 1820. We'll put a dollar 20 in. I feel like that's generous enough for the moment. Hopefully they don't waste my money. Okay. Go with dollar 20. Come on. I'm a poor bastard, but I know. I know what it's like living on the road. And there you go. All right, I donated. Everybody saw it. I'm a good person. Thank you, Dutch. Get on my way. Over here, we got my camp. Uh, we saw what I did last episode. Gave Arthur a clean shave. Made him all look nice and pretty. So uh, you can see that grow out during the duration of this travel. Over here, I think we have Hosea. How you doing, Hosea? Good morning, Arthur. <coughs> you right about this place. Good spot. You'll do for now. For sure. I think it's quite nice. I'm pretty sure we can see a town from up here. I might have to investigate that in a moment. Our horse, I don't remember if we gave our horse a, pro a proper name yet, so we'll have to investigate further into that, Bye, but... Yeah. Tennessee Walker. We'll call you a Walker for the time being. Walker looks like Walker's doing good. You know, while we're over here, we might as well see what Uncle's up to. Get to some business. Uncle, what you doing? Wake up. Ow! Whoa, whoa! Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? <laughs> Eventually. So, while the rest of us are busy stealing, killing, lying, Fighting to try to survive. You get to think all day. Well, it's a strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. 
Do you want to head into town? See if we can find anything out. <laughs> sure. I got some errands to run. Great. Go check the horses are ready. If you're gonna take the old man into town, you can take us too? Well, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Karen's about ready to murder Grimshaw. <laughs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take them a robin. and you're worried about house chores. Let's go. Fair enough. You got me. Come on, then. <laughs> <laughs> At least Arthur's in here for the excitement. I can't civilization. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah, Valentine. <laughs> Very embodiment of civilization. <laughs> you ladies are going to love it. Okay, then. Let's go. All right. Out through the trees here, then take a left. All right, I guess we're going to be taking the ladies into town. Uncle, pleasure having you here. Can I go, uh, zoomy zoomy? There you go. I'm pretty sure I was going to say I was doing this series in, uh, first person. Let's see how atrocious this goes. Got to remember the controls real quick. So, Uncle. Okay, he doesn't want to talk yet. We'll get, out. we'll get out first, and then we'll have a conversation. He likes his privacy. As long as it's not copyright. Okay, yeah, I think we're good with this one. This is most definitely not something somebody copyright. Do you guys know any other songs? Any shanties by chance? Much more of a retro vibe type of guy. Ooh, there. Another one. I kind of suppose. Ah, oh, dude. Oh, I got lumbago. Oh. Um, Very serious. What the hell are you talking about, you lumbago? Out? Okay, I'll All out. right, I'll see what's going Some on. Some horse wrangling. We did this in Red Dead 1, but we haven't seen that yet, so. Go on. I'll pretend it's like I don't know what I'm doing. Lumbago. I just don't know what I'm doing. You all right there, friend? Senor! Oh, hey, you couldn't help me get my other horse back from over there, could you? That one? Yeah, I got you. I'd really appreciate the help. I'm worried this one here will fall down me too. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just, just sure. get your horse. I got him. Do I need to? Do I need to use this? Oh, there. Okay, we'll go. We'll go cool. I'm gonna call you Snow Biscuit. Hey, Snow Biscuit. Let me study you for a second. You're beautiful. It's a shire. Nice. Whoa, Snow Biscuit. There. Chill. Easy. Chill. We all Easy. chill. Okay. Snow biscuit. No. Easy. No. Snow biscuit Whoa. is a man. So what about Easy. snow bagel? Biscuits and bagel, they're kind of the same thing. We cool? Hey, we cool. Nice. There, boy. They're yeah, cool. I like you. Ranger's cool. I like Ranger more. Sea biscuit's cool. Sea biscuit. Snow biscuit. My bad. Or no, we decided on Snow Bagel. I am terrible at names. Eh. This Come way. on, Snow Bagel Biscuit. Come on. Your dad, Pop, is over here. Do me a favor. Do a pose. There's some ladies watching. Thank God there's not a train coming right now. Hey, I got snow biscuit bagel turtle. Here you go. You heard gentleman, sir. A gentleman. No, not really. I was just trying to impress the women. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, anyway, thank you. By all means. Catch you later, old timer. Hey, uncle. How's your little bacon? 
ladies. Come on, let's go. <laughs> to Valentine. <laughs> You're turning into a regular old fairy godmother there, Arthur. What's that supposed to mean? It means you got a heart. A small one, perhaps, hidden deep inside, but a real one. And you haven't, your pulse of old lizard. Mm, lizards have hearts. Well, Arthur, I'm proud of you. To be honest, you lot hadn't been here, I probably would have robbed him. <laughs> well, you did. <laughs> <laughs> I'll admit it came across my mind. I was gonna take a snow bagel. But I didn't. I'm a good man. Woo! Now those sheep. <laughs> or is that uncle? <laughs> oh, very funny. This looks like a decent little town. Other people. Finally. Look at all that snow on the mountains. Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh, no. Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the likes of us. Or to do any real work. She's a society lady now. Okay. Take a good look around, ladies. Let's see what we got here. I'd say it seems like the regular old town. I got drugs. Chairs always on the right. Well, you can pick up some bounties there, Arthur. Heaven forbid I take some bounties. Yeah, well, that's a young man's game. The one is Lebago getting in the way. Yes, we can get up to some mischief here, all right. Just remember, keep a low profile. Will you remember that, though, Arthur? Probably not. Mm -hmm. Park up down the end there, near the stable. Slide on up. Get some of my right. inconspicuous, inconspicuous are, beverage. Just like I said. Cultural center of civilization. <laughs> Man, at its finest. Uncle, what are we doing? Well, we're gonna do what any self respecting maniac does put the women to work. <laughs> With pleasure. We'll start at the saloon. Okay, just stay out of trouble. Don't get yourselves noticed. Right, I need to get something from the stores. Okay, well, we'll see you at the general store when you're done. Come on, ladies. Imagine we're in Paris. Come on. The Eiffel Tower's so, so that's big. How you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, in my youth, I used to be known as the one-shot kid. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna ask why. <laughs> you are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. I'm a man but of particular taste. Me. Desperately. You're my favorite parasite. <laughs> no. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. Jesus, Arthur. <laughs> I lied. Ringworm. Then rats with the plague. Then you. You are my third favorite parasite. This is the place now. Come on. Morning. What's good? So, what do you need? Hell, a drop of whiskey for a start. You know, something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. <laughs> Always thinking ahead, ain't you? You're looking a bit tired there, Arthur. Why don't you pick up mm. some coffee while we're here? Plenty out on the shelves, but I got more out back. We well, all just got regular old copy. Anything door. in particular? Some hair pomade. Am I looking in the right shop? Ah, my <laughs> hair pomade. Totally not coffee. What do you got? You got ground coffee. You, anything, you got canned uh, salmon. Know. Maybe. Mm, you know, I really don't like ground salmon, so I'll take the smoked coffee. Let me examine it real quick. I want to look at it. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So, you're actually buying for once? Mm -hmm. Are you feeling all right? Coffee. Mm -hmm. See this? Young folk got no buy respect one. for their elders no more. You know what? I, okay. You know, I if work in done, coffee. I'm going to buy a outside. second coffee. I won't be too long. Did y'all just freaking see that coffee come out of nowhere? What the hell is that? Hang on, hang on. I'm going to buy a third one. What the hell is that? Is that how you get people just to keep purchasing them? You just freaking make copies appear out of nowhere? I don't even want to know where this. they're coming from. Harp. What is this list of yours? I got a lot to replenish after that god-awful time in the mountains. All done. Thank you kindly. Looks like a bottle of whiskey, and that's about it. it. Trick. We yeah. got a nine that's iron, too. That should or I guess it. a six Let's iron. Wait for them outside. Can we check out the gunsmith later? Gunsmith. Oh, here's your good health, sir. 
<laughs> and to being down here off that mountain. Absolutely. It's a funny world, you know. This time in my career, I pictured myself being married to an heiress. Gentlemen, I think I got something good. What? What? I snuck into this fancy house. Acted like a servant girl. Usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace. Train full of rich tourists heading to San Denis and then cruising off to Brazil. Okay. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night as to get to the docks in time for the tides in some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yeah, I know it. Yeah, yeah, it's right out near New Hanover. <laughs> right, it's real quiet out there. Sounds good. Yeah. Where's Tilly and Karen? Uh, I think at the hotel. They were picking up some drunken fellas that they was gonna rob. Why? It seemed easy. They have been gone for quite a while. I guess I'll go see if there's any trouble. There's usually okay. trouble. There's Tilly over there. That does not look ideal. Excuse me. Get your hands off me. Excuse me, senor. Remove your hands from the lady. Get off me. Get off of me. Get your hands off mm. her, friend. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get off her. Do you really want to make it go like this? Or what exactly? Oh, apparently that was not a solution. <laughs> oh, yeah, we'll retry that one. <laughs> I was going for intimidation, you know? Back off or die. He took it as. No, I'm good. <laughs> Alright, let's try that again. Oh, that was great. <laughs> Sir, can you please leave her alone? Get your hands off of her. Who are you? <laughs> Get the hell off of her, you son of a bitch. Hey. Damn right. Hey, take it easy. There's no problem here. There will be if you don't get out of here right now. You got a prop, bro. You don't want to try that. You lose the game. Oh, he ain't even got a gun. Ah. Getting lost. I ain't doing this with you right now. Yep, yep. I wouldn't either. Go away with Uncle and Mary Beth. They're across the street. Okay. Oh, let me step back Thanks, up. Arthur. Yeah. Next time, please don't do this. Can we? Can we try Arthur. something else? Keep your ear Look out. Listen her. for around. You know. You I'll know what I'm saying? I'll go see about Karen in the hotel. <sighs> Karen. Can I help you, sir? Hi, um... I'm looking for a girl who came in here earlier with a drunk feather. Mid yeah. Mid-20s, blonde. You'd remember her. Yeah, they're in 2B upstairs. Are you, uh, a friend of his? A friend of hers. Uh, yeah, both. I'm a friend of both no of them now. now We're about to be acquainted. Excuse me, senor, please remove your hands from the lady. Oh, hell no. Get, get this door open. Hey! Who are you? A friend of hers. Get out of here, buddy. I paid. Ain't paid a hitter, you goddamn animal. Come here. Let's make this quick. Come on. Uh. Oh, I shit. Paid for nothing. I think you two could stand me. Bro, we got a problem. Back off. I don't know why my controls aren't working right now. It just. For some reason, my controls aren't working. I don't know if my first person fisting controls ain't right. I have to check that out. Let me, let me just, you know, he caused me some trouble. I'm gonna take what I need. Very well. You okay? Ten cents. Ten cents. Okay, I guess you did pay her. So, so I'm gonna forgive you today. Man, but stupid bastard, stupid bastard was boasting about the bank. The bank? Sure, I know small town banks are usually a waste of time, but. This is a livestock town. There's lots of cash sometimes. Interesting. Okay. Keep investigating. I will. Yeah, Back I'm gonna to have you. to check my uh, first person fighting controls because they were being weird. Thank you, Arthur. I don't much like being saved, but when I have to be. I understand. You okay? <laughs> sure. He only punched uh, me. Arthur punched him a lot harder. 
Uh, funnily right, enough, hey, I only punched him once. Guy over there looking at us. Well, I weren't think... you in Blackwater a few weeks back? No, no sir, no, I sir. was not. Where are you from then? Oh, you were. Well, I definitely saw you with a bunch of fellers. Me? No. Impossible. Listen, buddy. Dude, come I'm here just shaved. Me. There's no way you'd be able to identify on, me. Get... Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. I don't like this. Me neither. Go get the girls home. I'm gonna go have a word with our friend. I don't know whose horse this is, but now it's mine. Excuse me, sir. We, we need to have a discussion. Where'd you go? Get back here right now! No, 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 no. We, we're gonna have to have a little chat. We, we're gonna have like a five second chat. Five seconds. Five seconds of your time, bro. Come, just, 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 just come here. If you're sorry, then we can talk, right? If you're not sorry, then we're not talking, so... So, yeah! Whoa, 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 whoa! Hey, buddy! Please! I can't get up! Um, okay, so I got a question for you. Why are you telling lies about me? No, no! I, I, I got it wrong, partner. I got it very wrong. Now, please help me up. I ain't never been in black water. Then why are you chasing me? Why are you hanging I on a ledge? I unfortunate face. Yes, yes, me too. <laughs> now, please pull me up. Please. Okay, I can't, I can't really risk all this business, but look, bud. I, it, okay, okay, come on. Come all on. Right. You're pathetic. Come Let's on. go. You remind me of a guy I found in Las Vegas. His name was Benny. We're not going to talk about that now, though. Get your ass up here. <sighs> People. You okay, partner? No. No, I am not. Well, be not okay somewhere else. I'm a mess. Yeah, I well, can see that. You ain't dead. There is that. Give me Brooks. I think it's best for both of us. If we pretend this never happened. Very true. Well, I agree. You saved my life. You're a good man, and I, uh... Here. You want a pen? It's one of them steel ones. Oh. That's very kind of you. <laughs> but I'm not a good man, Jimmy Brooks. Not usually. You see, I was in Blackwater. I kill people. And maybe I should have killed you. Should I have killed you, Jimmy Brooks? <laughs> I never saw you. Not not now, not not never. You sound like a smart man, understand? Jimmy Brooks. Of course we do. Jimmy Brooks. <laughs> I will remember that. I've got a good memory. I have it. I haven't. Mm -hmm. Not not one lick. Not one cent in this year old mind. Good man. Good man, Jimmy Brooks. Alright, how far are we into our recording real nice quick? Day, we are only 23 yeah. minutes. Okay, I don't want to go into the journal just yet, so let's keep going. Uh, what do we got nearby that would be interesting? Oh, actually, no, you know what? We'll go ahead and do that for a second. You know, the camp's expecting me back soon. We're on a very nice mountain ledge. I kind of like this. Let's go ahead and pop a squat for a second. Um, can I set up camp? Is that, is that a thing? <gasps> I can. Okay. This is how I'm going to try this. We're only 23 minutes in, but we got some stuff that already happened. All right, uh, is there anything I want to do here real quick just while we're uh, playing around? Could make some meat. Got some tonics, ammo. Interesting. Weapons, hunting, horse care. Okay, show all. So available. I thought I had coffee. Didn't I just buy coffee? Or do I not have something else for it? 
Yeah, I got a coffee. Requires a percolated. Ah, okay. I gotta buy something else for it. Uh, in that case, let's just cook some stuff real quick. There's some cookity cooking going on. Arthur, go ahead and eat something real quick. Stuff? I don't even know whose horse this is. This isn't my horse, right? Like, didn't his, isn't my horse different? Mine was a walker. Eat that one too. Mm. Grit, gritty fish. I'm not a fan of grit. Let me try some venison. Get some venison in me. We've never had venison jerky or venison bacon. That is like one of the top meats I've ever had. That and bison. Bison's interesting. We're gonna go ahead and enjoy this one. Eat it, Arthur. Have a good one. All right, that's awesome. Now, I'm gonna flip my camera around. We're gonna go to this and just kind of have Arthur chill out here for a minute. I go camera one. We got the book up in the top corner and camera three where we just do this. Isn't that cool? All right, for now, I'm gonna go ahead and have it on because sometimes I know the game likes to throw some stuff at us. So let's go ahead and get into the book real quick. Or no, sorry, I mean, I'm gonna transfer to three. Bingo. All right, go into the book, give it a little bit of room. Let's go ahead and untie this bad boy and investigate it. I like the noises in the background. That's why I wanted to keep the audio on. Now, Arthur Morgan's Ar <laughs> Arthur Morgan. Oh, good lord. Arthur Morgan's journal. That's where the AM comes from, obviously. The first page that we had here, I don't know if anybody really remembers what happened, but good god that a lot of things happen. We had the boat plan that we originally saw all this money coming from did not work out. Very atrocious plan. Very, 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 very atrocious plan. Um, after that, we've decided to remember on the uh, O'Driscolls. We've discovered that the O'Driscolls were along in the mountains. We had Dutch and the gang. We actually added Sadie Adler into our uh, collections. Past that, we got um, John Marston. John ended up getting attacked by some animals. We ended up saving him, so he's good and he's recovered. If y'all know who he is, he's back with us, back with the team. Um, after that, we actually have uh, the old mine, which was our first campsite that we ended up having to uh, abandon to come to our new location. So this was a little drawing of the um, campsite from the outside that I tried to do, very crudely made. So, uh, as you can see, there's a hole there. That is uh, one of our wounds from the past. Flip to the next one. Got all the people at our new location. Horseshoe Overlook. You got me, Dutch, Adler's Hill, blah, 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 all the way down the list. I just like to keep a tally of everybody that's come across us on our journeys. Let's uh, phrase it that way for the time being. On the other page, we ended up finding some uh, white-tailed uh, deer. We had the O'Driscolls come back. We had Kieran, I think his name was, that we uh, captured. I didn't end up talking to him at the campsite. We'll talk to him when we get back. And then we had this whole train situation. We did get a little bit of funding from this train. We were able to get out of, um, pretty sure it was the O'Driscoll's plan originally, but we were able to get out of the mountains after this train score. I don't remember what we got. I think we got bonds. I don't even know what bonds really are. But yeah, so that was decent. I ended up falling off the train and um, eating about a pound of concrete with a bunch of gravel and rocks in between. So that's where that comes from. Now, on to the next page. Go ahead and stand up for this part. <sighs> what did we have already happen? So we had the campsite where we saw everybody. Yeah, that was on the other page. Um, we took the ladies to town, so that was kind of decent. But uh, I don't want to phrase this. I don't know. I want to do something with the cart. Let me go ahead and nah, I'll put the knife away for the day. Seems like a good idea. It always seems like a good idea. I'm like, nah, I'll just use the pencil sharpener. Be a good boy. I don't know if you can hear it in the background, but good lord. Okay. Alright. Um, so yeah, we have the cart break down. We had our cart. So I'm gonna start by taking the ladies to town. I don't know how I wanna do this. We'll do some dresses. I'll represent with some dresses. Dresses and Mystique, that's how we'll do it. And then they wanted to go to Valentine.
a little crackly campfire in the background. Good sketches. Did y'all hear something? But uh, we'll do like a <laughs> like a little hat or something. I don't even know. Horse is getting impatient. Do something like that. I don't know. Kind of a bad representation, but there's multiple of them, so I'm gonna I'm gonna do one more. We'll have a lady with just a neck crop type one, I guess. I don't know how you'd phrase that. You'll have some sweeties. Oh, calm down, Walker. Oh, you're not Walker. You're somebody else. My bad. Calm down, not Walker. You'll have like a bow or something. There you go. And then we'll give her like some like hangover hair. Yeah. Okay. And then there was actually uh, three girls. This one will have like corset top kind of. That'll lead into uh, the poofy part of the dress, which I do not make dresses. So I have no idea what it's called. But it looks kind of like that, I guess. Go ahead and add some crude details in there. And then we'll have like the little piece here and the little piece here. And I'm gonna butcher it if I do anything. So I'll give her a little uh, sun hat, yeah. Okay, so we got the girls. <laughs> A little bit cooler texture around the ladies. <laughs> this one with a straight circle. The gals. Okay, the gals, they wanted to go to Valentine. Valentine. And then, uh, real quick, oh my god, do you guys hear that train? It's so loud. Okay, we're gonna write down Jimmy real quick. Because Jimmy was a thing. He's the guy. He, he's not Jimmy. I'm gonna remember his name. Jimmy something. Oh my god, there's a train going by. It's so friggin' loud. Why did I put a camp here? This is a terrible idea. Alright, Jimmy. Jimmy boy. So the girls, they wanted to go to Valentine. I don't really have anything in particular with Valentine yet. We'll get some more details on there soon. Uh, but we got Jimmy, the girls. I wanted to go back here. Um, who did I want to add? Uncle. Is Uncle not on here? No, Uncle is not on here. So. Uncle. No idea what his name is. Apparently he's old as crap, but there you go. So. Girls, wanted to head to Valentine. We gotta remember Jimmy. He did not remember us, but he did. I'm gonna find him. In any case, back into it. I'll go ahead and uh, close up the old Arthur Morgan journal. Throw the ribbon back over it. Let's get back on our adventure real quick. Go from this to that. Boom. Right back into it. It's nighttime. There was a train going at nighttime? I meant to go to this camera and then go to this one, but don't I know how to plan things? <sighs> Arthur Morgan, so solemn. Getting really adjusted in much hair. Your coyotes in the background. Totally not gonna die one day because of this. There's another frickin' train? Good Christ! Alright, you know what? Let's yeah, get my uh, thing back in alignment. Alright, there we go. All right, Walker, you ready to head out? I think I'm ready to head out. Gain or lose weight or we'll be shown in the health core thing. Okay, cool. What do I have next? That's Javier. Hosea told you that Javier, Bill, and Charles will, were already in Valentine. So it'd probably be smart to go talk to them while I'm out and about. So let's head back to Valentine. Maybe we'll learn something new about Hosea or Charles. Or Bill. 
out this fire real quick. Look how beautiful that moon is. What a lovely environment. Got to really thank Rockstar again for creating such a good... I don't even know. The light pollution. You can see all the stars. Oh my god, my wife would love this. What the hell is that? That thing right above us, is that a... Um, is that a constellation I'm not recognizing? I'm not good at constellations. I, I can, like, in real life, tell where the Big Dipper and the Small Dipper is. I don't think I can tell where they're at here. I think they're over this way. But, um, yeah. Walker, let's head back into Valentine. Got some gentlemen to talk to. Let me put that on my map real quick. Click. There we go. And we can be off. Yeah. It's only back into town, so it's not that far away. I'm just terrible at directions. I'm gonna have to figure out how to start doing these things by directions because uh, I plan on playing um, the Elder Scrolls Morrowind on a journal journey somewhere in far, far the future. But, um,. Yeah, I don't know. Sounds like such a cool idea because I heard you actually need like a freaking um What am I thinking? You actually need like a book to figure that game out. Oh, there's a doggy! Look at the doggy! Y'all got corgis? I'm looking for a corgi for no particular reason. Oh, calm down. Yes, yes, yes. I am aware. I am aware. You are probably not a corgi. I still want to look. Hey, where'd you go? Hey, buddy. Come here. Come here. Pretty. What, what are you exactly? Let me take a look at you. You are a blue tick coon hound. Very nice. Excellent hunting dog. Good for tracking raccoons. I would not have guessed. Hey, You're boy. a good fella. All right. It seems like we got something in here for us to do. And I think I actually remember what this is. One of them was a girl anyhow. But you had been friends back in 73. You rode the Alabama. Good day, gentlemen. There. Hello there, mister. <laughs> Put that in your fucking book, Fredo. This is Jim Boy Calloway. The Jim Boy Calloway. Who? The gunslinger. Fastest left-handed draw that ever drew breath. He once killed 14 men in a fight at Lucy Hollow. What are you waiting for? How do you mean? Well, I reckon right now, kill him yourself. I don't want to mm. kill him. I want to deify him. He's a god. I'm trying to write his biography. How's that going? I think I prefer the duel. Either <clears throat> I'd kill him and be able to be Baltimore's finest ever gunslinger, or he'd kill me and I could be set free from ever having to speak to him again. Well, you're starting to understand something very important. What's that? The joys of gunslinging. It's win-win. Freedom or glory. That's brilliant. I would also say that, that gunslinging is if probably... Good guess. heavens! What's your name? I don't know if anybody else heard that, but that was my computer throwing me a notification. Really. I mean, Slightly deaf for now. Not try and shoot in the back. All that other stuff, it's, well, it's bunk. But you fought duels. Once upon a time, I may have. And you ain't interested in fame. I don't think so. Strange. But you like fortune. I need money, sure. Okay. And forgive me, mister, if I seem a little desperate. I am a little desperate. This book... I've got to make a thing of it, and, well, there's a whole list of gunfighters. Legends, every last one. Emmett Granger. Flacco Hernandez. Billy Midnight. Black Bell. Never heard of him. Maybe you can go Seem and like speak some interesting folk. Ask him about Calloway. Any of them get uppity... Shoot him. I can't believe I just said that, but you're telling me to, to shoot a gunslinger? Wow. Fools like him. Ask if he was the greatest, and then if they get uppity, shoot him. Does sound a lot worse than it did in my head. How much you paying? Well, a lot. <gasps> Half the proceeds of the book, if you help me get it written. I'll see what I can do. Ha. Oh, get photos. Okay. And there are notes on the back of those portraits that should lead you to him. I'll see what I can find out. I imagine we'll be stuck here upon your return. Here or some other flop house. Best of luck with the interview. I guess I'll get on my job. 
Let's see what we got. All right, you got some pictures. We're not gonna do anything about this today, but might as well look at them. We got Black Bell. Interesting lady. Got a rifle. Oh, good lord. If you wanna take the time to read that, you certainly can. Arthur Morgan is not in the reading mood at the moment, so. Go ahead and throw that on there. Check out Black Bell eventually. All right, Walker, or not Walker, you are somebody else's horse. American Standard Bread. That is quite generic and boring. This is your temporary horse. It's a buckskin. It's for racing. Cool. Cool. Well, uh, you will be uh, Delta. Yeah, you're Delta. We'll go with Delta. Damn, close the store. I was going to buy a gun. What about this sheriff's office sheriff you got any uh any particular business you need of a man of my caliber enough of us well look here maybe this is our man you a bounty hunter mister i might be maybe it depends but i'm guessing you ain't here to pass the day turn yourself in or discuss the finer points of county law not particularly and i don't need to know much more than that Till I got a reason to. All right. You smell that? This here's a livestock town, mister. Attracts delinquents and reprobates like flies. Now, I'm not a fellow to pass a quick judgment, but I've been around long enough to know you don't hire a saint to catch a sinner. You bring me what I need, and I'll pay you well, and I won't ask no questions. So, what is it you need? Why don't you have a look at that poster on the wall over there? Need Jesus to down Christ, this sheriff is terrifying. He's been poisoning folks with his miracle cure from here to Ansburg. Killed more than Landon Ricketts without even pulling a trigger. Get some kind of sick satisfaction out of it. The teller over at the saloon says he thought he saw him by the gorge straight north of here. You think you can bring him in? The money's good. I need him alive, though. I want to make sure the women he witted get compensated before he swings. I'll see what I can do. Well, good luck to you. See if I can drag him in. Kicking and screaming, probably. And we need him alive. That's an important point. Alive. I got it. Yep, gotcha. Hello? Oh, am I just on the mission now? Okay. Um... How do I call my horse? Come on, Delta. Me and you apparently got a mission to go on. You're gonna stretch your legs today. Let's go. <sighs> Off we go. Hopefully the, they're all gonna be here when I get back. Howdy. Man, I'm talking about some miracle tonic snake oil you know hang on wait a minute don't i i could have sworn i had some snake oil yeah i got some snake oil and he's killing people with this oh we're gonna talk we're gonna talk hmm definitely an atrocious taste killing yeah. people with this though the hell is he doing pardon gentlemen On Delta, almost there. Oh. Okay, Delta, I'm gonna need you to stick right here for a second. Just had some of that snake oil, I think. Going crazy. What did I even have? Excuse me, sir. Quite lonely out here at night. You Benedict Albright? Oh, sir? Huh. Kind of look like him. And I was told he'd be up here. No, uh, not me, sir. It's because I want to buy some medicine. 
And oh, this is some I interesting heard, foreshadowing. I heard good things. I'll pay in gold if, if you could help me find him. It's just my mother's real sick. Oh, well, if that's the case, it's for a sick woman, I'd be happy to help. I'm a healer, you know. You sick a bastard. Man. Finest medicine in the state. <laughs> I'm sure it is. Thank you for informing Game's me that over, you're a mister. dick. Put your hands so, taking you in. Take it, get ready to what become fault? money. Apparently, that stuff you're pushing is killing folk. There's a price on your head. I don't know. It ain't my business. Come on, partner. That's crap. I'm a healer. Big healer with a gun in his face currently. Speak to spirits. I'm a scientist. Folks get real angry for no good reason. This, this is a mistake. Keep your hands up, buddy. They only want you to check your pockets real quick. I have to insist that this is a mistake. Don't be a fool. No! No! Oh my God. Dude, could you not? Oh, you're so heavy. Come on. Come on, Fat Albert. We don't even know who that is yet. No! Oh God! I said no! <sighs> oh, you saved me! Yeah, on, say buddy, good. Get ready to be turned into money. You're taking me in? It's just for question. Oh, hey, you saved my life! <sighs> Ain't we had enough drama? I, I'd be better off jumping! I, they expressly told me not to kill you. What? Oh, this is about you. At the moment? Uh, don't jump! Uh, or, or what? You can't shoot me, no! Please. I'll take my chance. Come here! Uh, bye, friend! Oh my <sighs> god, this is supposed to be a five minute run. <sighs> Alright, let's go Del- You're not Delta? Hungarian half bred How did I get another horse? Whose horse is this? Oh my god, where did he go? Shit. I got across! Oh, come on, come on, come on. You're gonna be Charlie. Swing to the edge. Uh, grab on to something. All right. Oh, God. Look out, the rapids. Hold your breath. Thought I had him. Known as one of the greatest gunslingers. I figured that meant I was good at Keep rope. Your head Water. Hey, yeah. if you could not die, that'd be awesome. Okay, now. Get over here. Come oh, here. my God. Come here. You, sir, are a pain. Get out of the water. You're more trouble than you're worth. Would you stop? Jesus. Me, I'm the judge, the jury, and apparently the executioner if you don't stop. Thank you. All right, what do you got? Some medicine man. Probably have money. Three dollars. All right, not 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 bad. Some miracle tonic and some hair pomade. Oh, look at that! You yeah. we use the same hair pomade. I'm gonna borrow that. Get on here. <sighs> All right, Charlie, are you ready to go back to town? Yeah. Gotcha. Most likely drowned. Good heavens. So, um, so how, how you, how you doing? Okay. Good, good to know. I think I must be suffering from exposure. Oh yeah, it's quite freaking hot out, isn't it? Oh, sun's cooking me. Oh, I seem to 
keep blacking out. Yep. I'm sure you are. You do seem to keep blacking out. Yep. You might be a uh, narcoleptic or something. I don't know. It's crazy. Yep, and the police, they're really sick. The police are so sick, man. You wouldn't believe it. They need a guy like you. They really do. Come on. Okay. Yep, the police, they're in so much need of your help right now. Like, so much. Gentlemen. Oh, my lord. I wasn't expecting you back so soon. Mrs. Calthorpe was just leaving. Yep. Where you want him? I'm selling the back. Thank you. This guy's freaking heavy. He's a minute man. Here, just, just sit on the freaking floor. Oh, oh, that's a terrible mistake. I never did it. Any of it. I thought I told you to shut up, partner. But I told but you. But nothing. Shut up. And, uh, good luck. Yep. Have fun healing the rest man. of the prison system. You ask folks for forgiveness. You remember this, partner? I've already forgotten. Now, sure. Um, how much was you offered? Uh, fifty dollars. Here. Thank you. Thank you, madam. Ma'am. Uh, please remember what I told you. Ah, <sighs> how's the day's work? Pulling in the scum. All right, Charlie, you did just fine. I want to check you out, Charlie. You're a Hungarian half red I believe. And the important thing about them is that they um, are apparently standard. Pretty generic horse. Dapple, dark gray, standard, decent speed, decent acceleration, temporary horse. You are Charlie. All right, cool. You are a that lovely looking gentleman. Or, Get rid of it or I will remove it for lady. You. What? You got a problem? Okay, okay, keep your hair on. I already gave you a warning. This is it. What? It's no all good. Calm down. You're coming with me now. I didn't even Don't do anything, me. bro. Chill. Don't need to make a scene. Just come on quietly. Five dollars? Are you kidding me? What I just did? Oh my freaking mask! Oh my god. Thank you for wasting all of our time. Much appreciated, officers. You know what? I'm gonna. Hey, hey, watch this. Watch this. Hey, officer. Watch this. Hey, friend. Morning, son. Watch this. <laughs> watch this. <gasps> Ooh. Mm, do come in. Well, it's really the catalog you want to look at. It's got everything in here. <sighs> hmm. What if I just wanted to customize my own guns? Okay, that's cool. Um, we also have the carbine repeater and my revolver. Let's back All out the and, and let me check and the catalog. What type of guns y'all got? Again. I had a recent run-in with the walls. I was looking for the uh, coffee thing. Why would that be in a gun shop? I do not know. So, sir, it has been a pleasure talking. I am yeah, going to Worth get... a shot. Yeah, yeah, okay, we'll talk later. Thanks. Okay, do I have my mask on? No. Let's go back into first person. Oh, that was ridiculous. Um, I'm gonna go to the store real quick, and I think that the store has some accessories. I wanna grab some groceries. Your recent crimes. Back for some more provisions. What? Have a look around. Okay, let me browse your ah, catalog. Let me just look in here. Uh huh. Provisions? Is that what? Yeah, I was about to head to clothing, but I don't know. This is food and stuff. The what are dry goods? Uh, none of this is gonna help me. Or actually, wait. Okay, there's the coffee. So do you have the coffee thingy thingy? I don't need brandy. Been a rough kind of town. I don't need as any of that. I, I don't need hair made. I just got some. Funnily enough. No. Cover scent lotion, that'd be kind of neat. Nah, I'm good. 
uh, predator bait, live crickets, coffee percolated. There we go. I want to make some coffee. Yeah. Nice Thank you, sir. Beautiful watch that keeps perfect time. Makes a gentleman of any man. Yeah, I'll take that, too. It's all yours. Lake lure. Can't purchase that yet. Gun oil. What's for clean? And I'm pretty sure I'll buy a couple of those. Again? Yes, right. again. Horse reviver. Jesus. Put steroids in these things. Can I take them? Ooh, and I can buy different items. Let me check accessories. Is there anything in here I want to purchase? I like gloves. I'll throw on some uh, some rifleman's gloves. Check them out. Interesting. That's I will take these, days. these ones. The gentleman's attire. Yeah. All right. I think we're done. Got twenty-seven dollars to my name. Got some uh, new items. I can make coffee now. That's cool. Might I'll go make some free time. More. Um, what else do we got? Careful out there. Okay, apparently I messed up with the cops and decided to wear my face mask. Um, so I need to do something else. And my only problem is, what else is there to do? Reverend Swanson found something on the train station by... I don't have to go all the way over there just for that. Could. Don't wanna. I could. Or I could go hunting. I don't think I have any uh, particular hunting grounds marked around here. This is a building here. Obviously, that's something. Exploration is going to be interesting in this game. I don't know how I still want to match some types of things. I think that hey, move it. every... I'm sorry, Jesus. Every um other video, oh, I'm going to go back and forth. Do I? Hey, it's Walker. Cool. How you doing, Walker? Turn you around real quick. Every other, um... Jesus Christ, Walker! What made you think that was necessary? Hey, are you... Are we good? Are you good, bro? You are... Oh, my God. Well, I'm... You are so dirty. Oh, my God. Let me... Come here, buddy. You're, you're having a rough day. Hey, boy. Here, ha have something to eat. What what do I even have? Just just take that. Yeah. Get you some more. Uh, okay, Walker. Are are we good? Are you ready to go? You're a beautiful fellow, but we got we got stuff to do, and we need you to stop playing around. Oh, so, as I was saying, every other episode, I think I'm gonna go back and forth between. Mainstreaming, mainstreaming a mission and then doing a couple side quests. So, like, since it's early in the game, right now we're doing some smaller missions, but as the game goes on, the missions are going to get a lot longer, a little bit more dramatic. I might make an episode about exploring into a certain direction or just going around in new locations. Um, I really don't know. I wanted to get some of the story started. That's why I'm fine doing... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Nope, put that... Thank you. Stop, 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 stop. I'm so bad at these controls. If I go on my map, <laughs> they're there. So let's just do this. I'm pretty sure this is the one that progresses us forward. <sighs> but yeah, I know that this is going to be a long running series. That's why I'm thinking that every other episode... I'll go back and forth between this and then um, the main story, side quest, and then main story, side quest, main story type of thing. Excuse me. I'm walking through. Shut up. I don't want to do another wanted mission yet, so we'll just run up here. Oh, we got a nice piano going on. And some ladies. Ooh. Go in there and have a good time. Walker, don't do anything I wouldn't. Gentlemen. <laughs> hey, all right, there we go. Hey. Arthur, Arthur, come here. Come here, come here, come over here. I want you to uh, to meet our friends. Pleased to meet you. 
Well, ain't you just the toughest Teak Mountain man? Oh, you be quiet, Anastasia. Anyone can tell this one is a pussy cat. Exactly. Yes, he's a pussy cat. And that's so worth her. Whatever you say. How much As you I'm cost, covered anyway? in mud. Ain't that a nice way to talk to a lady? Oh, I didn't know I was talking to a lady. <laughs> Excuse me. I mean, I wouldn't well, want me to go I'm down sick. on anybody either with this face. Good with God. The women, yeah, regular dandy Man, my heart's charming. just tweaked out so <laughs> hard. Y'all were oh, here. Man. I'm sorry. I dread to think about it. Hey, hey, hey. hey there he is. Watch where you're going. Take it easy, are you about pal? to kiss that guy Take or punch him? Huh? Oh, <laughs> and we have our answer. <laughs> oh, we are right into it. Let's oh, shoot these bastards. Sorry, partner. Gotta beat you up. Who are you fools, huh? <laughs> you ain't familiar with the Arthur combo. To call it you? Oh, okay, he's familiar. Not that familiar, though. Hey, can you get off of him? I know he's kind of an idiot, but still. Oh, God. Use a freaking chair, dude! I'm so gonna hurt you! Get off me! Thank you! I'm here to use some help, Morgan! Oh no shit. Hey, I got some problems to talk to you. You want some too, huh? Okay, I take the help! Oh my god! Hey, back off! You're going down in the So says you, Colossus. Alright! Arthur combos! Stop hitting me! You're making a real fool of yourself! Oh, you are so gonna regret this. Okay, I'm regretting it a little bit. Could you, could you not? Hey, Tommy boy, come on! I got your friend with the sick. Oh my god, you're good. Would you stop? Arthur, come on. Come on now, big boy. You won't be so pretty. If I didn't have my good boots on, I'd so kick you right. Hey, get off me. Oh, now he's the big boy. Now he's the big boy, Tommy. I'm the fucking big boy. Thank you for talking. Stop, stop. Please, please, I beg you, stop. Come, sir. You won the fight already. Surely that's enough. What business is it of yours? No business. <clears throat> no business, sir, but please, I beg you. <sighs> I'm the one fighting Colossus, and everybody's like, Boo hoo, Colossus. I see, Arthur. Look who we found. As always, about. Josiah Trelawney. The very same. <laughs> well, I, Josiah. I down in New York. And miss all this glamour. You must be joking. How are you? Well, quite well indeed. I went to Blackwater looking for you, gentlemen. You're not very popular there, it seems. Good ah, God, I am covered. Javier and Charles, I've missed you. And Bill looking as well as can be. Gentlemen, always a pleasure. You're right. We ain't too popular in Blackwater. We left a lot of money there. And young Sean, it seems. Sean, you found him. Yes, I have. He's being held by some bounty hunters, trying to see how much money the government will pay them. I know he's in Blackwater, but there's talk of them moving. Well, if we step foot in Blackwater... Uh, ah! <laughs> well, then we're dead men for sure! There'll be Pinkertons all over the place, but 
If he's alive, we gotta try. Yeah, of course. It's you they want, Dutch. Always is. Charles, go find out what you can, carefully. Josiah, take Javier. Arthur, go get yourself cleaned up. Join them when you're ready. Well, what about me? Well, exactly. What about you? What does that mean? Oh, Bill. Uh, I feel disgusting. You know, I could use I could use a bath. Isn't there a, isn't there a nice little uh, squeaky place around here? Thanks. Oh. Uh, excuse me. Hello, welcome. Oh, it's uh, um, you. I was actually yes, just wondering if I, it yeah, I, I came back. Check. I'm, I, I really don't need any more trouble. I'm but not actually here for trouble. I'm here it. for um, I was just we'll protecting a lady. business pleasure. Well, all behind us now, I suppose. So, what is it you need? A, a bath, perhaps? Yeah, I just need to get cleaned up a little. I am atrocious right now. So, uh, I I use a bath I, yeah i just i just need a bath do i do I just go back or something or good talking oh thank the heavens hot water <sighs> nice and calm hey we gave you a little bottle for 25 cents and i can get some pour my own oh that's so nice Gotta go through the promise of um I'm I'm good on the help. I'm I'm a I'm a good boy. I'm I'm good for now. Th good. Thank you though. Thank you. Alright, suit yourself. I might take up on the next one just uh I, I got stage fright right now, so um yeah, I'm gonna Oh my god. I wonder if this is all natural shampoo. And mud in the weirdest places, I swear. <laughs> the other arm, too. Got some underneath my knuckle armpits. What's a knuckle armpit? I have no idea. Uh, okay. I feel much better. Very nice. Get some of these suds off me now. I feel like a whole new man. Ah. <laughs> All right, that was nice. Feel nice and clean and squeaky now. I don't know how the hell they did my clothes in the time it took me to take that bath, but uh, that was nice. Thank you, sir. We'll call you H.O. Thank you, ho. Appreciate you. Alrighty, what do I want to do now? You just holding a shot? No, okay. I thought she had a gun. She was just chilling. Go to the map real quick. What time are we on? Uh, hour and 12 minutes. I got about 30 minutes left. I could make it. Um, we got another bounty poster. We could check out that bounty poster. And then we could also make our way back into town. We'll show, We'll finish up with Reverend, because I'm pretty sure this bounty poster is just me collecting it. It is in giving that we receive the true gifts of life that are eternal. <laughs> So give generously, for that is what this country needs to help each other. Um. Oh, it's you. Hey, buddy. How you doing? Yeah, how, how you well, doing? Sir. Well, you're just full of charity, ain't you? Well, I'm just trying to help where I can, sir. Or interfere. <clears throat> you you would have killed that man. What I do is none of your damn business, okay? Okay, okay. <coughs> okay, sir. <coughs> <laughs> Let's try and help each other. It's not about survival of the fittest. Can I um can I donate some? Check out your pamphlet real quick. What's this all about? Terrible Please organization side in your hand over. <laughs> be generous. Huh. Help people. Try to do what you can. Okay, can I can I donate some? 
I got a little bit of spare cash. Are you, okay, you're not taking donations. I'll, I'll, I'll take that as a you're not taking donations from Please me today. To yeah, I, I would like to, but it doesn't seem like I can for some reason. I don't know. <sighs> some people hold grudges. It's okay. I accept it. So, I hear you guys have more work you need me to do just to throw me in jail for. for Look no further than that wall, so you got Ellie and Swan. Twenty-five dollars for this broad, huh? The Terror of Valentine. What she do? Oh, there's a black widow. She has been seen in the Cumberland Falls area with an unknown male who may be manipulating her. Ellie and Swan. All information reward. Share same <laughs> Interesting. Alright. Mm-hmm. Put this away. That one? I'll keep it in mind. Check on it. She's sleeping rough near Cumberland Falls. Uh I will look into it. Give me a dime. What's up, kid? Me something. Yeah, I'll think about it some other time. I'm gonna play some five finger filet. I just wanna get a drink. I'm parched. Ah, oh, damn. Hey, man, how you doing? Hey, brother. I'm too old to get a job, mister. <laughs> Way too old. Can't we be friends? I mean, I guess we're kind of friends, sure. <sighs> sure. I'm so happy. I ain't had a friend in a long time. Yeah, we're friends. Long, long time. Yeah. My last friend died. Weren't my fault. They said it was, but they was wrong. Yeah, of course they was. It's fun being with you, mister. Can I hold you a second, mister? Can I? Um. That's kind of creepy. Uh, here, come here, buddy. You're. This is awkward. Okay, just come, come on. Come here, just give me a, yep, mm -hmm. Oh, you smell bad. Good. It's nice to be held sometimes. Oh, we used to hold each other in the war. You got sad eyes, mister. I'm gonna back up a little. You've seen sad things. Yeah, I've seen some pretty sad things. Remember with kindness. Oh. Mm-hmm. All right, that was totally not awkward. Ugh. I need something to snack on. What do I got? Salted O'Falls. Let me try it. Oh my God, that was atrocious. Oh my God. What else I got? Oh, I got some brandy. I forgot it's some of that uh, premium stuff. Let me take a little sippy sip. Oh, oh that is so nice. Mm. That was good. I like that. I have to grab some more next time. I almost want to play Five Finger Filet. Probably win some money. I got I got errands to do though. I got business. Come on, Walker. We got stuff to do. I'll come back some other time, kid. Oh, nope. Don't need the cinematic camera. I meant to go back to the map. Alright. I think I'm going to go visit Reverend Swanson real quick. And we will try to finish off with what's going on with him. Let's get a little bit of a, a view of the layout of the area and stuff like that. Well, we're going on a little ride. We got some decent stuff going on. Oh, sorry, pardon. Fast horse rider here. I don't take it slow. I lost your hat. Could you retrieve from your horse or your wardrobe? I lost my hat? What? Where is my hat? There's my hat. Yep. There we go. Got my hat on now. <sighs> I'm not finding any animals. It'd be nice to catch up on those two. Excuse me, Hi partner. there, mister. Mister? Have a good one. 
Charlie, you got some speed on you. I like it. Go quick. What? What the hell was that? Could have sworn yeah. I heard something else. Yeah. What in the hell is that? Okay there. Hello? There's somebody up here? Oh yeah, see we don't play that. There we go, let me double action. Oh Driscoll's? Oh hell no. You wanna go Oh no! Ah, that's what we get for running right into action. pull out of that damn well that sucked give me a moment we will take a seat pop a squat right here on the edge of this little cliffside uh, second death of the series. All right, and while we're here, let's go ahead and pull out the good old book again. Go back to camera phases. Boop. You remember that book up there? I kind of opened it while you weren't looking. So, not this page, but this one. Let's go ahead and zoom back in. Boop. Now we're back in. All right. What would we have uh, happen a couple seconds ago? So we went for some drinks. Drinks didn't go too well. Um, we went into town. We got our little coffee maker. Let's go and get like a little coffee brew thing. Coffee is very important. I'm a little bit of a coffee caffeine addict, so you know, coffee back in these days is probably a good one. I don't know how this is supposed to look. Get a little uh, little jug thingy right here. I feel like everybody is gonna know what I'm referring to when they look at this. A little sizzles coming out of it. So yep, we got our new coffee filter, nice and polished. Give a little polished stars on it. That's cool. Um, we had our coffee filter come through, or not a coffee filter, whatever the hell this thing's called. It's an easy Keurig, something or other. Uh, we went and tried to have some drinks, and that one easily turned bad. Bill start and stuff. So let's go ahead and get a bottle, big old bottle, just drawn on here. I like that. We'll zoom in real quick. And the bottle will have it going with swish swish and stuff, so. But we're gonna put this bottle. This is just Bill's Doom. Bill will. Yeah, there we go. Fill up some of that liquid area. And take away some of these stripes on the side of this bottle. There we go. Okay, so we had that happen. The freaking O'Driscolls, they came out of nowhere. There was the damn O'Driscolls again. Like, I, I just can't, these O'Driscolls. So I honestly think that with this one, that's actually where I'm gonna put my second puncture. We're gonna put it both on the first page because these freaking O'Driscolls be coming out of nowhere, I swear. <sighs> so with this one, what do we wanna do? Do I wanna slice through or do I wanna do anything in particular? I'm gonna cross out this O. Cross it out. Ugh. All the way through the next page. There we go. A little bit of paper damage. It even faded onto the next one. These freaking O'Driscoll's always getting it. Ah, it's three pages deep. See, that's why it's a foolish mistake. I actually made a foolish mistake. Three pages deep. Last time we just fell off the train. The train, we just had a little tick, but no. Three pages deep now. All right. So all's good. I want to put a little bottle. Now we're going to put a little... I don't even know. I want to put like a... Yeah, you, you do that, but I'm doodling real quick. Um, did I have anything else? We also took a bath. I don't know if I want to draw that on there. Put a little uh, bar of soap. Nah, we will be good. We had Bill's incident. We had our cut that came through. Got it through all the pages now. Unfortunately, it affected the gals area, but you know. Um, what ended up happening? 
They said a dude was alive back in uh, where we came from, but I don't remember what the hell his name was. I know it wasn't Jimmy. We gotta remember Jimmy just in case we do get discovered. But um, yeah, Mr. New York himself came back. New York came back. I'll put that down. New York. Back at it. Put that there. Hopefully we know what that means. I'm going to have to remember what New York's name is. Maybe when I make the uh, setup a little bit convenient, I'll go ahead and come back and forth between it. Yeah, let's go ahead and go with that, though. We got some coffee going on. We got the bottle. Bill ended up having that. A little bit of... A little bit of depresso espresso coming from there. Bill's always getting into fight because he will. Bill will. And then we had New York come back. He had some interesting information for us. And the damned O'Triscolls. They killed us a second time. Ah. All right. Let me go ahead and hold off there on the book. How much time we got left? Ba -ba 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 -ba. Still got 20 minutes. Go ahead and pull it open. Head back to camera position 01. And. Ooh, look at us looking off into the distance. So pretty. Camp position two. I have to get used to that. <sighs> oh, my bad. Didn't mean to call you that hard. Am I hungry or anything? Oh, I'm definitely hungry. What do I have for food? Ba -ba 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 -ba. Got some kidney beans. I have some beans. I think these are from the new one. Oh, yeah, they're still a little. Oh, that's interesting. Those are the ones from the mountain. Oh. Well, those ones are not. Okay, that was a little bit better. You can tell because the ones from the mountain were a little bit. Yeah, yep. <sighs> yep. All right, let's not get tricked by those Adriscals again. That last one, he grazed my shoulder. Hurt a little. Quite upset about it. Don't want to have to deal with some problems again. Whoa, now. Ooh, whoa, whoa. If you ever hear gunshots or anything, it's best to approach slowly. Easy. Whoa. I want to... Nah, probably better not to. I'll catch some at the end when I head back to camp properly. Yeah. Pardon, gentlemen. time to get distracted a second time yeah. I'll catch it on the way back there's some beautiful mountains off in the distance come on Charlie almost there we're heading to the same area right we're heading to the right location yeah, RS. Okay. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Don't need to be here. There we go. It looks like somebody else has passed this area. You We're going. I don't think you should just be wandering around here, friend. Neither do I. We there got a. Uh... Go. Not a thing happens around here without an Adriscoll saying so. Oh, really? Is that so? Make sure to tell the O'Driscolls I, uh, I wanted revenge for when y'all killed me last time. <laughs> as soon as y'all said O'Driscolls, you messed up. Damn O'Driscolls. Alright, what you got on you? Take that. What you got? Thank you, chaps. Appreciate it. All right. Good talking, gentlemen. Next time, don't start off with a minute drink. Girl. Probably won't die as quick. Okay, boy. Let's go. All right, Charlie. Let's keep going. Yep. Came out of nowhere. You bitch be looking at where you're going, laddie. I'm in a Driscoll. Oh. Easy now. Oh, it's a pig. Oh, excuse me, partner. All right, Charlie, stay here for a minute. Be right back. Reverend. You here, Reverend? 
Hello, uh, my bad. I'm looking for the Reverend. Oh, what? Reverend, are you gambling? Out of the damn way! Excuse the hell out of me! Reverend! I know you ain't in there with the money you could be putting in the communal box. Mr. Morgan! I took your advice, sir. I took your advice. Then your god has finally deserted you. What you talking about? I Ooh. took your advice, sir. I have removed myself from Morpheus's embrace. No more shall I sink, sir. I am free. I am free. You don't seem free, friend. You seem drunk. Sit down, Reverend. We ain't finished. You ain't finished. Look at him, he's finished. None of us forced liquor down his throat, friend. I just want him to play. Well, firstly, we ain't friends. Don't make no mistake on Ooh, that subject. Ooh, Archer's got Secondly, a little, uh, five o'clock shadows going on right now. The reason it ain't never been one of my strong points, neither. But see, and I do just fine. You want to step outside or deal with business here? I just want him to finish the game. Why can't we all just get along? These are good men, Arthur. They're children of God. They are children of God. Yep, children of God, I'll be damned. How's about you playing this place, huh? That seems fair. Fair? Sure. You want a game? <sighs> oh, he's already got money in. I guess sure. I'll play. I'll play a few hands. Well, sit yourself down then. Let's see what we got going on real quick. You already got chips in the pool. I'm Luther. This is Marvin. Yep, still not friends. Fortunate for you both for being gentlemen about this. Same yeah, goes yeah, for you. Yeah, yeah. Let me see what I got. So, ooh, ooh, ooh. Now you two know each other I mean, anyway. damn. Don't damn. seem like mm -mm. the best of friends, if you don't mind me saying. We go a long way back. And now you're his chaperone? I guess it's something like that. Can we play? I'm about to say, I'm more interested in the game than anything else. Let's do it. Hey. There. The same what you call finishing strong. Big pile of nothing. Nice. Could have been worse. <laughs> Thank you, gentlemen. I'll take this. <laughs> Thank you, Reverend. Like a gambler challenge. Check your log. Ooh, gambler indeed. Wish you'd left some booze for us. I'm parched. I'm about to say, hope did, your friend's did he still breathing. Take all the booze? He's very quiet. Ah, he'll be fine. He just, he just out there. What we got? Uh, uh, yeah, we're about the same. I'll, I'll hold. We'll check on it. Let's see then. All right, what we got? Oh, that's a miracle. Oh, I should put in a little bit more. Mm hmm. Yep, there. Thank you. I'll take all these, hand them off to the other gentleman. All right, last one that I'm going to pull. Well, this is proper sport, eh, friends? I'm about to say, decent affairs. What do we got? I got bullshit. Ah. <laughs> Damn. You're real lucky. Had that ace. Mm. I was hoping something would reveal itself I'll in the end. It. All right. Good job, chaps. Good, good, good one. You know, I, I feel like I just lost all the money I gained. I'm gonna go one. Uh, one, one more. We'll and go one I more. Can't get a look in. Glad I ain't in your seat. One more. Let me throw some chips in. There you go. Got two on it. I must say. You have a lot less stories than your friend did. Yeah, I'm kind of quiet. Hmm. 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 I will go one more. He might have two matches, but I feel like my queen duo will win. Here. A little bit deeper. Delay. Come on, Marvin. Have a look. A pair of queens. Nice. Just take this back. Thank you. Feel like I earned my dues. 
And you know, gentlemen, I actually think that that's going to wrap it up for me. Gentlemen, this is getting too rich for me. Sit down. We'll go ahead and do this oh, real done, quick. Throw Martin friend. in there. It's been a real education. Come on, Rip. Where is he? Where'd he go? Who? The Reverend. Where it? <sighs> Excuse me, gentlemen. Reverend! Reverend Swanson! Where'd you go? Dylan, that, uh, spade in the There you go. Got that spade in there. We'll remember our little gambling duo here. Won a dollar eight. Hey, y'all seen the Reverend by chance? I was doodling in my journal. Or actually, here, let me throw it in there real quick. Plus a dollar dot oh eight. Look at us winning. Boop, see it there. Boop, gone. All right, Reverend, stop playing. Come out. Have you lost your mind? Reverend. Reverend. Don't make me use my detective vision, Reverend. Ooh. Y'all, y'all smell that? Smell like booze. Smell like booze somewhere over here. Reverend, are you done playing around or not? What in the hell? Hey, hey sir, off. can you can you You'll let go of him? He's a man of God. You stay out of it. Get your hands off him now, you son of a bitch. Listen, buddy, what we ain't we ain't problem? like this. He's with me. You can be cool. You Let's can be cool. Be cool. Did, did not just. You don't want to know how many people I've had to do this to in the last couple minutes. Oh, people like you make me angry. You're Get going down. off. Excuse me. Fair damn fools. You're damn right I am. You're Come on. a bigger uh. fool. Oh, he's got the combos. What is it with you? Are you a boxer? Uh. Oh. I'll kill you both. Oh, will you? Get off of me. What? What? It's like a cheetah. How did he get behind me? See, you don't understand. I'm actually Batman. You don't get that reference. Oh my god. I'm gonna keep the law on you. No, I did not kill him. Oh my god. Reverend, we got some problems, man. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to run after this guy now. Hey, hey buddy, Goodbye, we gotta talk. Hey. Oh, Jesus. Listen, you did not see anything. He's not dead. He's injured, okay? Injured. You can take him to the hospital. Don't make me do this to you. I said stop, damn it. Okay, okay. Oh. Okay, well, uh, this is the first time anybody's ever actually stopped. So let's you talk. Anyone? What you saw back there? You're a dead man. You understand me? Yep. I I won't tell us so. I promise. You promise, promise. Great crime. You can also rob them. Hey, hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Not a word. We gonna be cool? We cool? You need to stand up for yourself. Get going. All right. Uh, people. Now, where's Reverend? Reverend. Hey. Reverend. What are you doing? Drunken fool. Uh. Oh God, my heart. I'm gonna need to drink something. Ugh. Get some bitters. Oh my god, it tastes so bad. It tastes so better. It's just a simple mistake. Reverend, you what are you doing? Still be saved. Come back here. I need to talk, Reverend. We need to talk. And if I need to bring you back cowboy style. I'm gonna bring it back cowboy what? style. It appears to like this place. 
Reverend, you need to stop this now. If I have to, I will hog tie you. Do you understand? Reverend, we need to get going now. Reverend, get out of the way. Jesus, Reverend. Thank you, sir. No, 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 no. We got a lot to talk about. What the hell is wrong with you? What the hell is wrong with you? Throwing me off a bridge like there that? There was a goddamn train, you crazy bastard. Have I been bad again, Mr. Morgan? I'm sorry. Uh, I wish I was different. Let's get you home. Home? Yeah, that's a wonderful idea. I could have tea with Margaret. Margaret? Who's Margaret? What? Oh, good heavens. Come on, Reverend. Let's get you home. Walker, hopefully you're ready for a drunkard. I hear they're quite wobbly. God, are you still alive? I think I lost my hat because of you, Reverend. We're not gonna talk about that. We got better things to do. Barton? Oh my god, he's awake again. Reverend, if you could not, that'd be awesome. I kind of had enough of you today. And I'm sure Walker doesn't like you fiddling around back there. I told him. Pardon, gentlemen. What 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 exactly did you tell him? Uh, what are you mumbling about now? You alive? Let me get back to camp before we do this, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got tea, brew, southern cherry, maple, barley, earl grey. It's all back at camp. Amen. Yes, sir. Whoa. Here we are. Crazy deranged man. Gotta hitch it from the other side. Good job, Walker. Let me get this trash off of you. I'm gonna give you a bath in a minute. Come on, Reverend. Why is it always the heavy ones? Dutch. Well, I was wondering when he'd show up. Hey, it's been out here. <sighs> Heavy bastard. There you go. Now stay in bed, you would you? Sleep your way to salvation, my friend. Oh, what happened? He was just out drinking again. Usual. Poor oh. bastard. Exactly. Agreed. Well, thank you, Mr. Morgan. I'll keep an eye on him. He was lucky this time. Real there lucky. was a train. Damn fool. Damn O'Driscolls. All right, now that we're back at camp, what do I want to do? Nope, Jesus Christ, Susan. Popped up, let's get, let's get something to eat. I heard that the stew was done. Don't want to talk to him yet. Some stew? I want some stew. Oh, I gotta grab it from this side, I think. Grab a little bowl. Delicious. Oh, this looks so good. Oh, apparently I just said screw it to that spoon. Mm. 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 Oh, it's so good. This is mm. 
Oh my god, Miss Grimshaw. Fantastic. Fantastic, as always. I don't even know what you put in it. Oh, it's delicious, though. Ugh. Don't need to shave yet. Let me come around here. What's all this? Can I do anything with this here? No, I don't think so. All right, is there anything else I can do around the campsite real quick? Let's go ahead and make a little look at our donations box over here. You know what? I'm going to start a ledger for this donations box. Tribute. Let me go ahead and check it out real quick. All right, I'm going to go back to camera one. Got our book in the top. I'll start the ledger here. Uh, camp... Full screen it for a second. Well, I don't need to full screen it. I just need the microphone to be better. So we got the camp ledger here on the second page. So let's go back real quick. Um, does it have an active record of how much we've given? I think we put in like a dollar twenty at first. So we'll go plus dollar twenty, and then I'm gonna donate. Oh, oh, oh. I like even numbers, so we'll go with dollar eighty. Now we'll go two dollars eighty. That way I'm super even. Is that OCD or not? I don't know. Yeah, so we'll go two dollars and eighty. So yeah, two dollars eighty, and I'm gonna put a one and a two to represent what episode I donated on. These were both episode two. Pretty sure. There we go. Check that out real quick. Yeah, dollar twenty, two dollars eighty. So that would put us at four dollars for the campsite, which is awesome. Um, let's go ahead and donate that. Throw it in there, Dutch. You can thank me later. Um, I went ahead and had some stew. That stew was good. Got some meat over here. At the little infirmary i think i'm still setting up some of the items back at camp so it's not going to give me everything um available from the beginning I, I know that there's a bunch of side stuff we can do for now let's go ahead and give walker a little bath before we finish up the episode walker's been trying hard what no i don't no i'm not not we're not doing anything right now no what the hell is that over there no oh, it's another tennessee walker Cool. Oh, this isn't even my main horse. Jose, uh, we'll have to talk next episode, but I just I just ain't got time. I'm going to go all the way around you. I'm so sorry. Oh, that's a nice chocolate. Nice chocolate horse. How you doing, buddy? Patcha. Yeah, good girl. Wait, you're, you're my main horse? The Hungarian half-bred? Really? Your temporary horse. Yeah, this isn't my main horse. Where the hell's my main horse? Is this my main horse? No. Why do you keep saying this is my main horse? Okay, so that means that that one is my main horse, the walker. Okay. I was concerned for a second. This is your main horse. Okay. Annie's Mahogany Bay. Ooh. No, we don't have time. Let me feed my horse. My horse comes first. Do I got time to brush you? Nah, I need to buy a horse brush eventually. We'll head back into town and I'll get some for you. Yeah, Sorry, buddy. We'll get you cleaned off sometime. Patch you again real quick. You're a good fella. Okay. Let's go ahead and head back to our little campsite. Hello, Sadie. Good seeing you again. How are you doing? How you think I'm doing? Oh, yeah. <laughs> all right let's take a sit uh, arthur morgan himself pull that camera back just a little bit more i can inspect stuff apparently oh, i'm good on that oh no arthur sit back down please All right, let's go ahead and make a uh, note in our journal up there. The hell are you? Keep that camp ledger. 
I'm never gonna forget how much they've taken from us. All right, so what else did we end up having? We earned a dollar from gambling, so that's kind of cool. Let's go ahead and fill out this uh, very poorly drawn spade symbol that I drew here. Really need to work on my quick sketches a little bit. By a little bit, I mean a lot of it, but you know. Yeah, gambling though. Always a good habit to develop. Especially while young. Please do not gamble. Do not listen to anything I am currently saying. Um, so yeah. Uh Marvin, the whole gambling spree, that was all an interesting little series. But it might actually be worth some money. So we'll keep that emphasized. Um, the Reverend, we already had Bill in the bottle, so we might as well put another bottle here. Let me go we'll cut up one. We'll put Reverend Swanson here. I need to lean in a little bit. Oh, no, 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 no. I'll know what I'll do. I know what I'll do. The Reverend's a holy man. We'll give him the cross. It's a very poor cross, so I am sorry, but there you go. That's gonna be the other box. Have it spewing out. This is your wine, and this is your spirits. <laughs> All right, cool. Um, we had the Reverend, we got him back to camp. I wanna go ahead and give everybody a little bit of personality real quick. So with Arthur, I ain't got much. Bill, Bill's a bottle, so we'll go ahead and give him a bottle, a bottle and a beer, the beard. All right, like that. Have it carve in a little bit. Put a Jeffrey, bottle inside of his. How you keeping? A little cork. Girls ain't happy. Let me tell you that for nothing. Not happy at all. <laughs> Don't know why. A little moonshine bottle there. Let me give everybody a little. Little upper line. Ladies are having a talk. Alright, what else do I got? I got Hosea, I got Lenny, I got Javier, Charles, Miss Adlers. Miss Adlers, I'm not gonna do it any justice, but I'm gonna get her her uh, her ring. A little diamond on it. It's an atrocious drawing, but I would like to mention her marriage. There you go. I'll give that one to Miss Adler. I'll give myself a little cross section line, I guess. Boop, 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 boop. Cool. Uh, so she's got her ring. Got a little shine on it. Uh, Dutch always has his plan. So we'll say, we'll just put a planner on top of him. Plan. Arthur Morgan, that's us. We have died twice. We have our wounds here and here. You can see on the same page. Um, Reverend Swanson, I want to give him a bottle as well. So let's go ahead and... Reverend's kind of all-inclusive with his bottle stuff, so we'll, we'll do this. We'll put the bottle through him. Just like that. I feel like the Reverend's version of a bottle is a little bit bigger than Bill's version. Put a little on there. Cut a little in here. And then we even gotta add underneath. That's a bottle of spirits. There you go. Everybody's got a little personification now. Well, most of us. Miss Adler has the ring. Dutch has the plan. Bill's got the bottle because he had that incident. I've got a uh, Reverend Swanson on his. So yeah. There you go. That's all we've added this episode. So we got this going on. Here's like the first episode. This is our uh, overlook. Hold on to for the moment. Keeping the ledger of everybody. Go to the next episode or this uh, later in the episode. And then we have the girls. We had to take the gals to Valentine. That was interesting. And that ended up leading to this, which made me need these. Hopefully I remember to follow that. And then we had gambling over here. Got, got some mad money going on here. Me, ding, 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 ding. There you go. 
All right, go ahead and close this up. Give it a little wrap. There's that. Ugh. Sitting back down to my chair at my desk, rotating it. Boop. There we go. Thank you, everybody, for joining us this episode. It's been an absolute pleasure playing some Red Dead again. This world is so big, expansive, and immersive. We really do have a, like, a lot of stuff to eventually get through. Right now, we've only really looked at <laughs> this little nook of this area over here. But you can already see, we got... Whatever this is, what is that? Black Bell. Um, if I remember correctly, there's like a whole new area of terrain over here that we get to go through that goes all the way up. We have all of this area that we've kind of just been farting around in. Um, I might try to do some bounty hunting next episode. Get some of uh, these guys going on. I might even try to get Black Bell. I don't know if I want to go all the way out there, but I mean, who's this? Oh dear. That show is to try and rescue Sean from the bounty hunters holding him in Blackwater. See, then you have all of this, which if you see wanted dead or alive, that 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 is something down there. There's a lot of it. There's a whole other section of the map. Red Dead really does have an expansive, huge world for us to explore and quite a large story. So I'm definitely excited to investigate all that. There's so much in this game to get going to, and I'm glad that episode two is at least out of the way. Got some of our starting campsite stuff going on. Had a little bit of a priorities going on with the money and whatnot. We got some cash. How, how, how are we doing? Go back to the player real quick. That's me. That's Arthur. Uh, currently, we are of average build, fair temperature. We got some good honor. I like to be honorable. That's good. Um, health is at max, stamina is running a little low, dead eyes running a little low, but I don't think I have any conditions that affect these things. I, I don't remember a lot of conditions and stuff like that coming along in my last playthrough, so, um, have to investigate that. And if we go here, we can check out Walker, and Walker's currently clean and calm, which is good. I like that. Walker's a pretty decent horse. Pretty sure that's who we have currently. You can rename your horse up there. Okay, yeah, cool. I don't have too much more about Walker to investigate, it looks like, but uh, yeah. And then, got good old Arthur here. Got a little five o'clock shadow. We even shaved him last episode, so he's already glowing and going. That's I don't know how to like make anything particular. I'd make myself a little cup of coffee before we head out this episode, but go ahead and save that for next time. I'm sure Arthur will enjoy it. So, other than that, everybody, my name is Roxas Collect, and I am the regular gamer, of course. It has been an absolute pleasure having you all here once again with me tonight. If you guys can do me a huge favor and nuke that subscribe button if you're on YouTube, or go ahead and click the follow button if you're on Twitch, now that I'm kind of doing both of these for full time, eh, we'll see where I get. Other than that, do me a favor and catch me back on the next one. Been a pleasure having you all again. Have a good one.